What's up guys, Dopesar930 here again, uh, just follow up to the last video I uploaded, maybe, I don't know, an hour ago, um, I wasn't going to start working on the tutorial tonight, but I feel like I'm not in my right mind with my um, lack of sleep and all the work I've been doing the last 48 hours here, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I've done since the last video, um, my little cleanup job, and uh, we'll go ahead and do about maybe five or six boot tests and see what the timing we're getting on this guy is, so anyways, all I've done since the last video that I uploaded was um, snip the diodes, put some electrical tape, and make the wires a little bit shorter so not so long, along with this one as well. I just cleaned it up a bit. I also, um, for the CPU reset wire, I believe that's the wire, I rerouted it so it's coming up and through the south bridge before I just cut it wrapping around the side of the board. Um, so let's go ahead and see, again, what this is a Falcon. Right now I have, um, everything is switched to like regular in terms of the um, current or whatever, I don't even know what I'm trying to say anymore. Um, on the dips I have dip 7 which is for Falcon switched and then I also have dip uh, dip 1 switch so that's what I have and this is a Falcon so here we go. Alright, red ring, it does that randomly, it's weird. First glitch. Second glitch. Third. So that one was four. Then the red ring. It's a trip. I don't know. I really don't get why it does that. That one was shit, like one to two. That was really fast. Maybe if I let it, I don't know, maybe if I let it reset for a second or two once I power it off and not click it on. So that was one boot. Two, again two. It's, it's pretty bitchin' boot times. I mean, that's really is like the old school JTAG hack. Let me go ahead and let this shut off. One, two. There you go. I mean, that's that's kick ass. So with little tweaking, I mean, that was really nothing but cleaning up the JTAG wiring. So, um, I mean, again, guys, the red ring of death kept coming before um, when I was using this guy. So, I mean, if you keep getting it, you've tried everything, then um, this could be one thing. You might want to try the old school method, which is what I ended up using. But again, I'm not saying that's it. There's a ton of other things that it could be. Um, you know, you got to check a lot of different things. So, anyways, guys. This has been a test of the RJ Tech chip in my Falcon motherboard. Thanks for watching.